Hey guys, uh, Danny here. Today I'm doing an intro of my new sketch video. Um, I'm really excited for this one. My new sketch is going to be of Cody St. You. For those of you who don't know, he is a model. He is he plays Brett on Teen Wolf. Uh, he's been in a few other shows. I think he was he was in the 2013 movie All Cheerleaders Die. So. I love him. Uh, he seems like the sweetest guy ever. Uh, I've been follow I followed him on Instagram and I was looking through his pictures and I found this one that I instantly fell in love with. Uh, I'm gonna put that one right here. That is my reference for the sketch that I'm going to do. I'm really excited to do it. Usually I just do uh, like headshots, but this I thought it was just a really good picture, so I thought I could try something with it. Um, I'm, I thought it would be a cool way to work on some anatomy. Uh, he's got that snake tattoo, so I'm really excited to do that. Um, I don't think I've ever drawn a tattoo actually on someone before, so this is going to be new for me. Um, I'm going to use the same style that I've been using for my past two sketches, so I'm really excited. Um, and I just want to point out that I do have a lot of sketches planned, especially of Cody St. New and Dylan Sprayberry. I've just been finding so many pictures that I just want to draw of them, but I feel like I should explain my little rule that I have is that I cannot draw the same person twice in a row. I have like a list of drawings that I need. So say, say I'm drawing, say I just draw, I just drawed, I just drawed, I just drew Dylan Sprayberry as Liam Dunbar. So that would be Dylan. So then I drew uh, Tyler Posey. Now I'm drawing Cody St. New. So now if I wanted to, after those two, I could again draw Dylan Sprayberry, but there has to be two sketches in between that are totally different and I just do that in a way so that I can mix it up a little bit and I'm not like drawing the same thing over and over again because I feel like it kind of blocks me creatively and I don't think everyone wants to see a bunch of spam sketches. So that's my mindset behind that. Uh, so I'm going to get started drawing and I will film a little bit later when I have more done. I have started drawing, and like always, I have an eye. Um, I did not uh, film my layout part because I've realized that those are very, very hard to see because I do them really, really lightly. And let's face it, you all know I start with the eye. Let's let's get real here. So <laughs> I have his eye. I think I'm completely done with all the shading. I'm really happy with the way it's looking. But his other eye is giving me issues. The picture that I'm working with is at an kind of like a his head is slanted, so I know his eye needs to be about right here. But I, for some reason, I just can't get it lined up, and I've <laughs> I've tried three times already, so I'm gonna try four times, and let's really hope that I can get this video on the move. Because I really want to get the rest of his face done. Because right now, all I have is an eye. So, I'm going to put on a movie. Just get down to drawing. For those of you wondering, I'm going to be watching Flowers in the Attic. There we go. Progress. Oh my god, I'm making some progress. Ugh. It's taken me forever. But I'm happy with what I have so far. Uh, his eyes are lined up, got his nose done. Um, I think the next part I'm going to be working on is I'm going to start doing forehead and hair. And then I'm going to move on down to the mouth area. I also have to do this side of his face. So I think I'm going to just stick to like these three areas around what I have so far. Just to hopefully get it started a little bit. Uh, get into this sketch. I uh, really hope this keeps going as good as I think it's going right now. I've been working on this for a while now and I'm really happy with where it's going. 
Uh, I haven't started his mouth yet. Well, I've tried to, but it hasn't been working for me yet. So I did his hair, I have forehead, I got his ears done, I've started shading the background a little bit, so I am going to start his mouth. It is going to happen, I can't just leave it like this. But, so next I'm working on the mouth, um, I think I'm going to get a little bit more of the background in here, start on his mouth, and once I start on his mouth, that I can start on his hand, and then just go from there. So. Um, it's looking really good. I'm working how I want to. Things are actually getting done. The sketch is progressing, so I'm really happy with it now. Uh, I've only been using my 3H and my F pencil for this one. Uh, I want to keep this a, like a little bit on the lighter side. I am going to darken up his hair and like maybe the details around his eyes just a little bit, or at least over here for sure for the shadow. Um, but I'm really happy with where it's going right now. So I was just about to uh, edit and upload part one of my Cody Saintney sketch, and I realized I didn't film an ending to it. Uh, okay, so here's the ending of part one of my Cody Saintney sketch. Uh, <laughs> my bad. Um, yeah, so this is the end of part one. Part two will be coming up in a little bit. I am, right now as I'm speaking, I am almost done the sketch itself. I'm just, have to film a little bit more. I think I have to film the ending overview of the sketch and then the actual ending. Let's hope I don't forget to do that this time. And then it will be uploaded. So, you sh um, I don't think I'm going to upload it until... You know, it might be uploaded on Monday, if not Monday, Wednesday, because Tuesday's my book review video, so you'll see that up there. Um, yeah, so this has been part one of my Cody St. New sketch, and I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, please comment what you thought on this video, please request videos, please subscribe to my channel. I put out new videos every Tuesday, and I vlog and art vlog every other day. So, I am Iridania, and thank you for watching.